Um, these are just my straps for my fins, so yes, they're part of my thing. I brought two swim trunks. That would be all you will ever need. Um, and then my one mil rash guard and my one mil pants. Uh, for those who have never uh, dove in uh, the Bahamas, if you're doing night dive, you need to have a pair of pants and a shirt because there is a uh, jellyfish out there called a sea wasp. And uh, they will sting you <coughs> at night. <coughs> Excuse me, at night time. So they, they're there. So there's a quick overview of what I would have brought, what I would not have brought uh, with that. So let's go take a look at what I, oh, I also, but this is a carry-on. I brought my laptop so I was able to do some editing while I was on board. That uh, could go both ways. Just make sure that you bring plenty of SD cards uh, that uh, you can Once they get full, you can uh, put them up and then. So let's go take a quick look at what I would have, what I took for clothing. So this was my bag that I had all week, although it traveled in this bag right here, uh, just because I wanted the protection. So within this bag here, I was able to uh, store all of my camera cases, and these are all waterproof. This is another case for all the batteries that go in my GoPros. So two must-haves. Um, this is another protective case that I, if you can see, I keep all my 18650 batteries for dive lights and such. Um, that would be a uh, yes you need to take. Maybe not as many, but it depends on uh, how many lights you have. This is another uh, bag that I have. It just has some accessory pieces like a uh, reef hook. Uh, this uh, particular tool right here came in quite handy even though the dive boat had tools uh, this was able to uh, uh, help a couple of people out so uh, I probably would have reduced some of the things I had in here but uh, that's neither here nor there um, these were a pair of trunks that, that I kept dry all the time and I used those to sleep in I brought two shirts one long sleeve and one uh, short sleeve that would be a must this is my free diving um, uh, lycra outfit for um, uh, getting in and out of the water I would not have brought that because um, well for this trip I would not have brought that didn't I only used the top this is a GoPro mount for my BCD and this came in very handy and uh, I was able to uh, use that whenever I did the um, washing machine. It came in uh, quite handy. I did bring two um, portable dive lights. I would say that that would be a minimum. Um, we had a couple of situations where people's light died while we were at night dives and I was able to unclip one and give it to uh, a fellow diver. Um, one of the things on their website is uh, they talk about bringing a power cord uh, this came in very, very handy, uh, and they have um, um, that accessibility right there. These are for diving whenever I go for lobster. I would not have brought those. Uh, these are one mil gloves. That's uh, These are so small that I probably would bring those again just because, but not necessarily uh, in the warmer water again. So this is a this is a frog talk uh, a top. I would have brought this, um, and I brought another uh, pullover. I would not have brought this. The weather was incredibly warm. Uh, I didn't need it, but that's my own personal. I brought two of these towels. I would say one large and one medium would do you just fine. Um, obviously, my um, SMB. Uh, line I did not need this and that is really kind of a if you like it or not I did not swim with this because we were in large groups say there was 18 divers at a time 
and being able to hold on to my SMB was not an issue, so we didn't have to uh, worry about this.